Hi everyone, I'm Dr. J, the STEAM superhero. So welcome, thanks for joining me today. Before we get started, please do make sure to wash your hands before handling any of our materials. We are going to be doing an activity that is called Melting Snowmen. What we will need for this activity are two clear glasses, we will also need some warm water. I have warm water in here. We will also need a black marker. It's preferable if you use a permanent marker. And then an orange marker, because we know typically with our snowmen, the um, carrot is used for the nose, so that's why we have orange markers. We are actually talking about something that is eco-friendly. So we're gonna be using a couple of words that uh, might be new in your vocabulary, such as recycling and biodegradable. So we're all pretty much familiar with packing peanuts, right? And a lot of times we hear the word styrofoam. Well, we're gonna be using two different types of packing peanuts for our experiment today. And as scientists and STEAM superheroes, we are going to analyze these and we're going to create some, we're gonna find some evidence as to what is similar, what is different between these packing peanuts. So one thing we notice is that one of these packing peanuts is white, another one, the other one is pink. Their shapes are similar, but a little bit different. As we get started, we're still gonna draw our snowman. We are going to use our black marker and create a little eyes here for our snowman on the one and then do our little orange nose right here. So we have snowman number one is ready. And even though this is a little bit different shape and we're gonna be asking the question as to maybe why we're going to draw our eyes and our nose right here. So we have our two snowmen. We talk about styrofoam. A lot of times, as we know, styrofoam is not biodegradable. So what does that mean? Well, it's not very earth friendly. It's not planet friendly. It's not eco-friendly, which means it doesn't break down. It doesn't really dissolve and where we can do something else with it, like recycling. It ends up in these places, which you may, you may or may not have heard of. They're called landfills and they just stay there forever and ever and they won't break down. But we can identify which one is a very eco-friendly packing peanut and which one is something that will end up in the landfill. This is where we will need our warm water. So we're gonna pour that warm water in our clear glasses. And we like to use clear glasses so we can really see our experiment happening. Now, we make some educated guesses as far as which one might be the eco-friendly one, which one might be not so friendly to the earth. Well, we do have an idea that they are different, slightly different shape, different color. We're going to put our snowman in the water and start to see if we have one that starts to dissolve. So it typically takes maybe a couple of minutes for the dissolving action to happen. So in the meantime, we're gonna talk about a little bit about biodegradable. So what does biodegradable mean? And how do we get there? Well, as we talked about, biodegradable means that it is going to break down. It is going to dissolve. So what materials are used that will create it to break down and dissolve? It's cornstarch. Certain packing peanuts are made with cornstarch and cornstarch is used as an ingredient. 
Now, please do understand that the packing peanuts that are biodegradable, that do break down, that are eco-friendly, do not, do not, I repeat, do not eat them. In the meantime, let's see what's happening with our snowmen. Well, as a scientist, we can take a look and see, well, one is floating all the way on top of the water, and it's not doing anything in terms of dissolving. Our other snowman is starting to settle into the water. It's still sitting up on the top, but about half of it is now underwater. And now if we take a look with our white packing peanut, is it the same size? Right now, it's about 50%, meaning it's about half of its original size. Why is that? How did that happen? Because it is dissolving. Why is that? Because it is biodegradable. Why is that? Because it's eco-friendly. Why is that? Because it is made of cornstarch. We wait a couple of more minutes before we know it. Our snowman that is eco-friendly will have completely dissolved. In the end here, with our science experiment of our melting snowman, make sure to always question things. Don't ever be afraid to be the scientist and gather that evidence. Because as a STEAM superhero, and as a scientist, we have a responsibility to be kind to the earth. We only have one. Thank you so much for joining me today. One more wonderful view of our snowman. Make sure to please, after your experiment, wash your hands, and sanitize all of your materials. Thank you so much for joining me. Stay well, stay healthy, and see you soon.